Hey, what's up guys? Um, today I'm going to show you how to make a Minecraft server using Clan Forge Multiplay and how to secure your server from griefers. So first off, go to the Clan Forge site and log in. Here you can see all of the news that you have on Clan Forge about outages and updates. You can click on servers to see how many people are on your server and your server status by clicking on here but to create the stuff you need to should have lost what I was going to say to secure your server go to profiles I have a couple of them here go to new um, minecraft pick your mod the template will be default and then name it um, I guess okay click create it will say okay and then from here on you can go through and add oops as many programs as you want I mean as many plugins you will have all the add-ons you normally er, okay here to show you how to secure your server first click on essentials add it essentials chat you, just all the essentials except for group bridge and dr group manager and then add the rest of them once you have that go down until you see permissions add it then go to administrative add-ons look for restricting add-ons. There's lock it, chest security, which is good. Then you can go up here and look for some more administrative add-ons, but you really don't need any more than this. So first off, what you want to do is go to your config file and you can mess the server dot properties, but for right now I'm gonna have to save it. I unclick that because I don't want it to go to my server that I'm on right now gives you error sometimes see it's still on my one that I was using before because I didn't apply it to my server so here go to edit and if you ever need to click on this apply to server edit configure then here's all of your configure files what you want to do is go to permissions config it will not um, set up right it will come out like this so what you're gonna have to do is go look online like Google for a good or how permission should be set up but I already have one here in my profiles okay it's my band IPs permissions config okay see here's all the groups you could use I'll go ahead and give you this copy under the video if you like and users I'm just gonna go ahead and copy one okay let me go back to my other server that we were on click edit sorry config and then permissions config and just copy that entire thing into there and I will remove like all the stuff like the prefixes I'll just give you a clean guest default moderator and admin um, group and then down here at your users it sucks because with permission you can't promote people sorry I don't know why he's doing that so you have to go in every single time and copy one oops and paste one paste another one and then put their name here and then you set their group that you want them to be I have super admins um, let's just say D-E-F-A-U-L-T and it will be set as the default group which is or no nope, I think yep group default but I call them verified because whenever guests join they're the default group so they're guests and they can't build because it's on false right here that you need to put that as false 
and then for default you could put it as true build true because you have to verify them but every time that you want to come in here you have to go to your permissions file and add a new user with that and another really good thing to do to keep the griefers off your server is go and look for a mod called come on mod called IP git add it and what it will do is when you're in the game you can type backslash IP and then the player's name and it will give you their IP so you could push backslash ban IP and then type in their IP that it gave you without the port number at the end then they will be banned from their IP the only way they can get on is if they spoof their IP but hardly any people get bored before they even do that so they'll just go on to another server so that is really all that you need that I can think of for your server to keep it secured and set up on Clan Forge. But here's to go into your server properties. I know another thing is happening. It will not give you um, allow flight in the world. It won't have it on here. So you have to add it yourself. I'll put that one under too. Um, you could allow trees to grow, allow monsters to spawn at night player versus player damage, spawn animals, show shit, show in the server list, blah 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 blah, you know. But one of them, eh, put it around right. Hmm. Let's do it right here. Let's see if I remember how. And then now it will allow flight plugins for people who have um, fly mod. Also down here you have online mode where you can change it to false or to true. Oh, and if you're going to be running an offline or a cracked server, I would highly recommend getting a plugin called Authme. It's, I think, Authenticate. I don't know how to say that word. Authorize. I don't know. Authme. Um, what it'll do is whenever you log in you type backslash register and then you type the password you want and so every time you log on you have to type in your password so people won't log on in your account and then be able to fuck your server up with their with your per with your permissions that your group has but it seems about pretty much it all that there is to securing a server but if you're still having problems just go in here um, whitelist set it to true should I misspelled it true and then go down to your whitelist.txt and add everybody that you want to be in your whitelist um, that's really all that you need to do to secure your server now I've said this a couple times but I'm pretty sure now that that is it if you have any questions or comments please leave them under and also, this is for multiplayer, Clan Forge. Uh, Clan Forge. Don't rem don't forget. Um, please comment, rate, and subscribe, and I'll help you next time.